We are looking live at the horse-drawn carriage singularly going across the Edmund Pettus Bridge, the final crossing of that infamous bridge of the congressman, the great, the iconic congressman, John Lewis. There is so much symbolism here in the context of what happened on that bridge more than 50 years ago, where he, his skull was cracked, so many others injured as Alabama state troopers moved on peaceful protesters trying to cross that bridge. There would ultimately be three marches there. But you think about Bloody Sunday, then you think about that same bridge that John Lewis got to walk across again with the first African-American president of the United States. And now this. Naima, I know you are there. You, you are seeing it firsthand right up close. You talked about the, the rose petals that are strewn across that bridge. Uh, tell us what's going on in the crowd. There were different kind of reactions. Uh, you could hear the emotions in the crowd. You could hear people saying, thank you, John Lewis. You could hear the songs that uh, moved his spirit during the movement. I'm gonna let it shine. I'm gonna keep on a walking Lord, keep on a talking Lord, marching to the freedom land. And when you really think about all of that, you know, Selma, not a lot may be here in this town, but it is a pivotal town in the history of civil rights. And even though he is crossing that bridge, by himself at this very moment. He's not alone. The spirit of those that crowded that bridge, hundreds who crowded that bridge with him, are with him at this very moment. And as his name goes down in the history books, there are so many whose name has never been recognized or honored. And the spirit of all those people are with him at this very moment. Hosea Williams, Joseph E. Lari, C.T. Vivian, John Wesley Dobbs, every person who contributed to the history of civil rights way before the movement, Alonzo Herndon, even before the movement even took off, all those spirits are with us at this very moment because the life and legacy of John Lewis represents the eternal gift, the eternal gift that his life represented for mankind, for humanity, for making this world and leaving this world a better place than he found it. Um, there's a moment of silence. A, a lot of people are not saying much at this very moment. They're taking it in. What, what could you possibly say at this very moment? People are really soaking in this emotional moment, Brenda. Jeff?